Hi everyone, this is Cindy with Creating with the Heart. I have a really quick and easy card from the Wild Card 2 cartridge. And this cartridge is, is really fun. I, I think it's just got some really fun things. I think that the colors that they use make it look really kind of retro. And maybe it's supposed to be a retro cartridge. But um, I just have to remember when I'm looking at it just to change the colors and, and change, you know, really change the feel of the cards. So I really like how this card came out. I actually did the hammock card. And so it cuts its own card base. And the card base is three, about three and a quarter by five and a quarter. So it's kind of an odd shape card. I used the, what did I use? I used my mind's eye, um, let's see, one of the my mind's eye paper pads and I see it up here. So let me grab that if I can find it. Oh, I don't see it up here. So I use one of the my mind's eye paper pads and if I find it, I'll post it um, on the video. But, you know, a lot of these paper pads have cloud paper seems kind of to be the thing so I just picked one that had a, a cloud on it because I kind of wanted a cloud for my background so I just cut it about an eighth of an inch smaller than my card base and so I'm just going to adhere that on there and this card is really really easy because basically it already kind of has everything designed for you already just a matter of picking your um, your papers and any other kind of embellishments and I didn't go crazy with the embellishments so here is my main image that's going to decorate the front of my card and I used some of the pattern paper for the my mind's eye uh, paper pad I did a light amount of doodling on the tree area and I did some stickles some little um, yellow stickles which it kind of seemed to, to need but I think it looks really cute and that's just going to fit right here on the front of my card and so I'm just going to take off the bazillion glue dots that I have on the back of here I have like a bazillion maybe it's not a bazillion but I have a lot of glue dots on here so this was a really fun and easy card to make and the layers cut really nicely on it really easy to, to, um, to layer up you kind of have to, instead of gluing the sun part on to um, your card base because there's a little notch for where that goes, um, I went ahead and attached everything together as one piece to the hammock because I was going to put pattern paper down um, instead of just using a plain card base. So I couldn't see where to put that sun anyway. So I just attached everything as one piece. So keep that in mind, you have that option. Okay, done with the bazillion blue dots. Okay, so this is just going to fit there. And it's fine that it sticks out because this card will fit in a standard envelope because it's cut a little smaller. So there's this. And then I went ahead and I cut um, some grass out. I think this is from Create a Critter. Sorry, I've got some yuckies on my... And what I did was I layered up two layers of foam tape one on top of the other so that they would be a little bit um, taller than the foam tape that I used for my image so that my um, my grass will fit over my image so, so I'm gonna kind of smash this down Okay, so here is my card front. Isn't that cute? And inside, it cuts this Just Relax. So I'm just going to put that in, and I'm actually going to use just a quick pen. Quick, quick, quick pen here. There we go. Just relax. Okay. Just relax. And boom. 
there is my card. Thank you so much for watching today. This is Cindy with Creating with the Heart.